Hello everybody, my name is Fravis, and today's episode is brought to you by Top Decking. Top Decking, the strategy of champions. And me. So, uh, I lost an episode, but it, it wasn't much. I just got face-rolled twice, and then I face-rolled once, so they were really boring. But I did get, uh, I mean, I, I got kind of discouraged after after that one, because, it, believe me, the audio was it was unwatchable. It was just, it, it's never going to see the light of day. Wow, this is, this is horrible. I'll keep it. <laughs> but, um... Uh, I mean, obviously, 32 to 36 is kind of a jump, but, uh, okay, I'm going to try to record every episode of the home stretch now. I mean, I guess I was in the home stretch back back in the day, but there there has been a jump. Uh, it was a boring jump. Don't worry about it. It was it was mostly just uh, top decking. How about that? Yeah, let's just say top decking. All right, so we're heading up against my best friend in the world, Quadruple Boxes, who is who is who beat me to rank 40. So I'm very jelly of that shit. Super duper jelly, actually. Um, I'm gonna let this mirror hit me once, just just to make sure that there's nothing out there that I wanna deal with first. And then I'm just gonna start clearing his board every time. He's uh, he's doing uh, probably the Rakdos Rush deck or the Rakdos Sacrifice deck. I, it's hard to say. It's Rakdos and then Perilous Mirror because Perilous Mirror is in like every fucking deck right now because. Perilous Mirror is an incredible card, and if you're not running it in your deck, what is wrong with you? <laughs> it's they. they I, I hope they actually remove this card because when every deck benefits from that one card, uh, that card needs to go. Oh, that's terrible. Oh God. Uh, I'm gonna do this main phase just so I find that land that I really need, and I'm gonna hope it's a mountain. Uh, of course, why wouldn't it be? That's just dumb. Wait, wait, what am I doing? That goes in my hand. And I don't mind I don't mind picking up twin bolt right now. A little more removal. Little removal goes long. So uh yeah. In my infinite wisdom, I've decided to I I'm doing this post production by the way. I've decided to just mute the fucking microphone. And go on the rest of the game, not the rest of the game, like the next five fucking minutes of just talking into a muted microphone like a genius. So I I was like watching this in post and I was like, oh god, I can't believe it. I did catch myself doing it like after in five minutes. But I mean it, it was just so super awkward to watch. It was just like, um, Okay, I better re-record this. So here I am in post right now, re-recording it. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop re-recording in a little bit, but uh, it was just so awkward because I'm such an idiot. All right, <clears throat> so um, what, are we, what 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 what's going on? Oh right, right, yeah, I forgot. I'm playing a match game uh, against uh, quadruple boxes, rank forty motherfucker, who's uh, dropping. Not a whole lot on me. I mean, it was just a perilous mirror. But, I mean, it's, it's the beginning of the game, so who gives a shit? Uh, fourth lane is nice, uh, but I still don't have enough to cast uh, Chandra's Parents. So, yeah, I'm, I have to go with uh, at least put in one damage here. And I will be dropping uh, my Sigil onto that thing. So, I don't know what I'm talking about. One damage. It's going to be two damage. Unless he can pop it here. Oh, he does pop it here. Oh, shit. See, I don't remember if he pops it or not. So, it's like I'm watching this with you. It's crazy. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going to happen next. It's incredible. It's wonderful. It's a new experience. It, it's not. It's just it's stupid. Uh, so yeah, he shut that shit down pretty fast, actually. I mean, I had an idea, but it didn't work. Uh, I don't really have any creatures right now. I'm kind of fucked. I got the I got the one three, but that's not doing much. Uh, disperse. Okay, so I could bring it back up to my hand and then drop it again, but it'd have to be next turn. I mean, I guess I could... Ugh, whatever. I, I'll just drop another... Sigil, so like when and if I do eventually get my other mountain, I can I can really wreck face. Swinging for what I can. I mean, he's he's. I wouldn't say he's winning right now. He he does have a higher life total, but I wouldn't say he's winning. I'm I'm getting there. Uh, I I do have some removal ready, and I'll probably use it uh, if he drops anything, like that scares me. And I think they're unlocked too, so I have enough. Uh, they have the spell mastery, so it'll be three damage to anything. Unless, no, he, didn't. he has nothing, so that's fine. Uh, of course I don't get a mountain. Why the hell would I get a mountain? Um, what do I want to do here? Uh, yeah, obviously swing for one first. But since I have no other plays, I'm probably just going to drop these uh, sigils onto my 
onto my guy again. Because I have a mana for it. It's not like they're going to do anything else. So I do this? Yes, I do. Alright. Both of them, just God, please don't tap my fucking one red land, please. Uh, because I would like to keep uh, Twin Bolt and the uh, three damage one red spell open. Because, uh, I don't know, something, something about it seems useful. Not sure what he's going to do here. I really don't remember. Just dropping more lands and passing turn? That's not the best strategy in the world, man. He doesn't have anything. See how it switched straight from uh, his main phase to his end step? I mean, that's... That means he's fucked. But he's got, like, all the goddamn mana. I don't know what... <laughs> I don't know what he's supposed to do. Is this is going to be a face roll? I mean, I only have... I don't have that much land out. Okay, so it uh, looks like my recording is going to come back up uh, real soon, so I'll just shut up and... Uh, Take it from here. Yeah, it's the same amount of damage either way. I'm just swinging with this. I, I really hope I wasn't muted for like the longest time just now. I was talking, I swear to God. I just, I snorted and then I looked down and I went, oh shit, is my thing on? Oh God. Oh God. Well, I mean, I can always take a look at it in post and then decide to drop another fucking episode <laughs> and then you guys will look at me and I'm like at a completely different oh you know what I could lose and I could be closer to 32 so maybe maybe that'll be it all right who's he grabbing who's he grabbing uh, I am completely convinced that that thing is going to die so I'm gonna just bring that right back home he, is it just gonna pop it in response this isn't an instant so he can't like steal it right now. He could try to take this one. Yeah, alright, so this is definitely the Rakdos uh, self-sacrificing deck. Yeah, that's, yeah, I, I knew that was coming, man. I knew I wasn't getting it back, so it's coming right back into my hand. It's just what has to happen, bro. Uh, this time, I will be swinging with both. Oh, wait, no, I'm not. I'm swinging with this girl. Boom, boom. I don't really want to. You know what I do want to? I want to pop that piece of shit. Hmm. I wonder if he can do that five damage. Uh, I, I'm going to pop it now, just, just in case, man. I just don't... Tr oh, he's gone. All right, good. <laughs> all right, all right. Whoop, whoop. No, not you. Not you, you. All right. Good. Good. Maybe he was waiting on that. Maybe he had a handful of uh, creature steel, and he didn't have any way to kill it. And Bloodflow Connoisseur was his only uh, only out. And now that I popped it, he's he's got nothing. And now he's just sad, and he left. Oh man. So this is looking like another face roll. That sucks, kind of. Who do I want to die? Uh, y y you're gonna call me crazy, but I'd I'd, I'd rather have the haste. No, that's fucking stupid, isn't it? Because I got no. This is definitely the Rakdos self-sacrifice. All right, so I'm happy at least knowing that. Wow, I mean, man, making the right choice, guys. Uh, let's see. Can I put them both? Yeah. All right. So that's what's happening. This music is so soothing and beautiful. I'm having a good time, guys. I mean, I swear, I do occasionally win games. I, swear, I mean, I'm, I am terrible at Magic: The Gathering, but I somehow through through sheer luck and commentary and comedy i mr bean it through to the end i'm i'm the fucking forrest gump of magic the gathering I'm, i i wish i was that famous forrest gump was a fucking national hero even though he wasn't real just like we like our heroes baby damn it that would have finished him finished him off too all right um I think I'm just going to swing with everything, because uh, I don't want him to have something with Flash, which I don't think he does. I don't think there's anything in Red and Black that has Flash, but maybe he pops something. I don't know. The point is, motherfucker did. I got him. So. Wow, 2,000! I, I just like those even numbers. All right, so let's do two more and hopefully get to 90... or 39? Yeah, 39, right? Hopefully. Probably won't. Wait, that was the bagger. There it is. And if, um...
Joining session? Is that a good sign or a bad sign? It's probably a good sign, right? Alright, made it. Good. Alright, that's the default thing. Um, Mobius Chicken Strips, I, I just watched a uh, video of his, and he changed all his uh, decks into the same icon and background, or the same avatar and background, and I think that's actually a good idea, because uh, unless you're playing the default, it does give away what your deck is, and you know the less information towards your deck uh, that he gives your opponent, the better. I'm not ever going to keep a one lander. Not that this is any better. In fact, this might... Well, it's not worse, but... It's not good. I have like one fucking play, really. Uh, and I'm a big fan of uh, not giving out information. Or at least holding out on that information for as long as possible. And this guy might give, might give me away. I mean, they might see this and go, oh, you're, you're the fucking Thopter deck. Or at least there's some kind of artifacts. But you know what? They don't know what kind I am. Because a lot of Thopter decks still run uh, Juggernaut, maybe Esperzoa, that 2-3 flyer whenever there's an artifact out. Even there's a, an enchantment where you... I think sack an artifact and do a damage, or, or tap a couple artifacts to do a damage. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Um, it's got to be Perilous Mirror. I mean, it's always got to be Perilous Mirror. Perilous Mirror is clearly the best card in this game right now. Like, there is no way around that. Perilous Mirror is in every single deck. It has to be. It is too fucking good. I mean, remove it, by all means. Take two damage to anything I want. This guy's playing Gruul, I'm assuming Land Ramp. Or some kind of ramp. Um, yeah, obviously Chief of the Foundry right now, right? So I can swing in. For two, I don't know if he's going to block it though, so maybe I just want to go to his face. Actually, that's exactly what I want to do. I just want to go to his face, actually. I don't want to. I don't want to risk him blocking this shit. And besides, I can put down Chief of the Foundry next turn and get a hell of a lot more value for it. He is blocking. Eh, well, whatever. I guess I didn't have to swing with the mirror. But sometimes they don't block. Sometimes they get scared. I did do this after I. I mean, I had to after I put a land down. Ah, sir. There goes my dual lands. Boom. There's my only red source. So my Twin Bolt is now offline. That sucks. Uh, there's my Red Source. Here's my Foundry, Chief. Who's a robot. <laughs> I fucking love robots, guys. Robots are awesome. And I'm swinging a four ton. I mean, I'm guessing he's blocking the 1-3. That seems obvious. <laughs> All right. Uh, and he is losing that guy. All right, so he's taking as little damage as possible. I guess he's afraid of my uh, of my speed. Let's hope I don't get another acid, whatever the fuck this is called. What is? How do you pronounce that? Monvuli acid moss. I'm never gonna call that Monvuli. It, it's gonna be acid moss forever now. That kind of sucks. Mm-hmm. Well, the good news is if I leave my perilous mirror back, he dies. Bad news is I don't really want to leave my Perilous Mirror out, but the even better news is I can, because I have Sigil of Valor here. It'll be less damage overall, but at least, uh... At least, uh... I can get in for a bit more. Let's see how much. Five? Looks like five. Boom, 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 and don't tap my red. Okay, good. I always keep the red open. Alright, desperately going to try to rush this guy. He's got a ton of, of land, so I'm expecting a bomb pretty damn soon. I, I Unless you want to consider that a bomb. I mean, I have an answer for that right now, so maybe it's not. I don't know, man. I don't fucking know. I don't know anything. But he's at 10. He's on a two-turn clock starting now, I guess. So, good, good option. Lonerin17. Are you 17 years old? Or did you just pick this name when you were 17? He's about my level. No, he's not. Never mind. I'm five over him. I'm going to say level. It's rank. Uh, still worried about this, honestly. Uh, he's... Um... This really scares me, actually. I can do four damage to his face. So he's essentially at one if I want this to happen. If 
fiery impulse on that guy. Good choice. Nothing I can do about that. Um, do I want to keep my twin bolts up? Not really. Well, yeah, I do. I do. I do. I do. I do. I do. Never mind. That's stupid. I, w I want these up. I want to see what he's going to do. I, I, I want to put him to his face. I, I don't have any flyers right now, which kind of sucks. I need more. I need more flyers. That's what this. That's what this is about. You know what would be great? A uh, whirler rogue. Oh, uh, there goes my uh, sigil. No, my foundry chief. Okay. I guess that's more of a direct threat. Yeah, he's definitely stabilizing. That super sucks. Uh, I'm still killing that. One, two, three, four. Shut the door. Boosh. No more of that shit. And now he's down to one card. So actually, maybe I'm okay? Maybe I'm okay then, guys. Maybe I can do this. Um, yeah, I will definitely sack this now. Come on. Why do you always... This card in particular is giving me a tough time activating it with a right-click menu. Alright, because they got, they got the hasty hastes. So they're going in. He's only got one card in, in hand. I'm still at 17. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I mean, he was on a two-turn clock, but he took he took swift care of that shit. Yeah, now yeah, you go ahead, man. I'm I'm not doing not doing shit with that. You go ahead and have your one damage. That could be a problem, but not today. Oh wow, yes, thank you. And I have enough open. Yeah, I'm definitely going this way. It's not lethal yet. Not yet. Getting there. This is looking real good for me. Did he leave yet? I don't think he left, right? I love Sigil of Valor, man. Sigil of Valor is one of my favorite cards, honestly. It, it like, gives your other creatures vigilance, as long as they're one ones. And it's one hell of an evasive card. It's just, it, I really love it. And he's pretty much dead to Twin Bolt right now, unless he gains life, so... I'm happy. Yeah, he's gone. All right. Loner, owner, owner in 17. I'm sorry, buddy. Nah, you're going to have to do another one. If he can pop my other red, then he's uh, I mean, he's still dead through the air, so there's really <laughs> just nothing he can fucking do. I will just go ahead and take that shit. Uh, how much can he do? Not, not enough. I'm not even going to count it. I'm not going to count it. Uh, there's no way. I, I was thinking maybe he had, like, a wild growth or that uh, plus one, plus one for every... Uh, for every forest or creature. I, who cares? I'm, I'm not... You will be spending the evening in bed. Evening? Get it? Even? <laughs> oh, man. Fucking comedy, baby. Why don't, you, why don't you join the big leagues? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh. Leave game. 28. Oh, my God. All right. Uh, should I split it up? No, 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 no. I'm going to do one more because I'm probably going to lose this one. I'm on a roll right now. I'm having a real good time. Uh... I, I think I'm just, like, getting in there before my opponents can do shit, so that makes me feel kind of bad. But we can do this, man. We're, we're almost there. Hello, dude. What? What, what are you looking at? You, 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 you okay? Something's wrong with your face. That's a man. Wow. Why would you pair me up with Patrick? He's Well, maybe he's a good player. Because rank doesn't mean that they're a bad player at all. Well, this is awful. This is... Whoa. Oh, my God. Well, you know what? I got two telling times, so I'm, I'm actually going to keep that. So, yeah, Mobius was like, I'll change these up. So, I, I might. I might. I might pick an avatar and pick a, pick a background. See, see which ones are my favorite. And I'll just go ahead and grab that. But I also like the variety. You know? I don't know. Maybe I'll just pick one or two. But, but have them independent of, uh, of, the, uh, of the decks. Evolve.
Evolving Wilds, baby. I'm still confused as to why you would ever pick a gate over Evolving Wilds, because Evolving Wilds thins your deck. And yeah, I, I, I mean, I understand... Uh, hello. I, I understand the uh, the gates are two lands, so it's easier for, like, mana fixing and shit, but I, I don't give a fuck. I mean, really, who... So what? Uh, because Evolving Wilds, I mean, you're, you're probably okay with lands. I mean, I'm, I don't know, man. I, I feel like the odds are, since I don't have a red, I'm actually going to hold off on the Perilous Mirror and dig again with Telling Time. Uh, this is probably the wrong thing against what I assume is Golgari Elves. But I really want that red because I, I really want the, at least one Twin Bolt activated. Okay, so we're, we're both... We're both spending some turns trying to set up, which is good for me. Good for me. Let's try to get that red right now. Ah, oh, there we go. Good. Um, actually, I want another tiny time. <laughs> I just want another one. I don't have that many creatures to make Sigil uh, worth it right now. Um, I'm just going to start off with a Perilous Mirror. Just let him just let him deal with that for a little while. And then I'm gonna tell him time at the end of, at his end step. So yeah, I mean Evolving Wilds I mean i I just feel like if you want lands out of your deck, I mean okay, overall you're having less lands. That makes sense. I get that. And the gates do help with mana fixing a little better, but so what? Like mana fixing isn't that big of a problem. Most of your cards are single costs. I mean, uh, they need, they require at least one color. Um, you know what? I, I do want more lands. I like having five. And Chief of the Foundry seems like... Oh, God. I don't know. I want that Disperse, too. Ah, oh, fuck it. You know what? I got removal. I think the Disperse is going to be okay. And uh, my Fire Impulse is it's... Uh, should be all set right now. Um... Since my Chief of the Foundry is a little more valuable, I'm going to start off with uh, with my Thopter Engineer and then hit him for two. I mean, it's the same amount of damage, but at least this way, my Chief of the Foundry is more protected in case he has some kind of removal. If he wants to hit something with removal. Which he may not. I don't know what he wants to do. So far, he's been doing nothing. He's been losing life and scrying and drawing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, five lands, man. We're both there. So this is it. This is where we gotta start doing shit. That's not enough. Now, see, that that is... I, I would like to see a Disperse for that. <laughs> that is why I want Disperse. Um, I can kill it. I won't. That's not true. I could if I wanted to. I'm gonna hang on. Uh, my Perilous Mirror is holding back today. And I think I'm just getting in for this, too. Yeah, because he'll probably just take the two. And I don't want to spend two removal spells on that thing. I want to just hit it with the... the mirror. And then I can twin bolt one to him and then one to his face. I think I get a lot more value out of that. Wow, again? Jesus, man. What a hand. What? <laughs> Three. Boom, boom, boom. That's six life. He's not even swinging in. Alright, that's fine by me. Holy shit. Now I can definitely kill him. Uh, do I want to? Yeah, I do. Fuck. Do I want to use Twin Bolt? I'm, I'm going to split this up. I'm going to diversify, because I don't know what the future holds. Okay, that's a lot more damage this way. Oh, and hopefully we got him dead to rights next turn, and uh, I'll end it there for this episode. And then, I mean, it looks like I'm at 39, so let's see if I can push to the 40 next episode, which I will do, like, immediately after. Oh, that sucks. Uh, but he's still dead, because I got the Twin Bolt right in hand, so... Awesome! Alright, good game from my opponent, who is... Fairly low rank, so maybe this wasn't that good of a game for me.
he, he did draw a ton. I mean, he did... A, he, I'm not going to say he did a lot. He didn't really do a lot. Uh, the point is, uh, he's dead. I love you, buddy. Oh, I could have evened you. I, I double-clicked. Oh, he took off. All right. I mean, he knew I was playing that. Um, all right, guys. I had a great time. Let's uh, let's leave it there. Uh, and I'm, I'm just going to play it and then record it right now so I can finally get to my goal of rank 40. See you later.